I acquired this really neat piece of property out in the middle of nowhere. I've only been out here about twice. I left my camping supplies in the little cabin that's on the property. Nearest neighbor, a half mile away, a mile away, I don't know. Somebody found my cabin and they took my camping equipment. Not only did they take my camping equipment, they got the window unit. It doesn't have electricity. I, I'm not gonna use the window unit. It's still mine, don't steal it. I mean, but it left a hole in the wall. So now when it rains, water is going into the storage building. So today we put up posted signs. Today we put up security camera warning signs. Today we changed the lock on the fence because the lock that was there is the lock that was on it when I acquired the property. Who knows who has keys, but they don't have keys anymore. I'm gonna change the lock. That's the plan, to try to keep people off of my property. I think it'd be really cool to turn that cabin into an off-grid cabin. Would you watch me turn it into an off-grid cabin? Let me show it to you first. Let's go look at it. Well, here we are. So I'm a ways away from town. So this is the little cabin. It's basically just a 12 foot by 24 foot storage building. If you get it cleaned up, it would be a really cool place for the family to hang out. Ooh, don't know if you can see it on the camera, but right there is a big wasp nest. Those guys are mean too. Here's the back side of this little cabin behind it. There's another RV with a shed built over the top of it. But I really love this little deck. It's super cool. And the view, if you came out here and you cleaned the underbrush out a little bit. This is Louisiana, we're flat. Everything in Louisiana is flat. So you can't see it on camera, trust me. That is way down <laughs> to maybe one day turn this thing into an off-grid cabin. This place is so cool. If you think I should turn this into an off-grid cabin and film the whole process, let me know. I think it'd be fun. I mean, can you see it? Yeah. How cool is that? It actually has electrical hookups and uh, it looks like it has water too. Man, it's so cool. But the last thing I need right now is another project. But this one would be fun. This one would be for me. I think I should do it. I should do it. I should totally do it. <laughs> Die! Ah, oh, I hate red wasps. They're like the worst thing on the planet. There's no purpose in a red wasp. If you know why red wasps exist, let me know. I don't think there's a reason other than to hurt me. Oh, there's one that just landed up there. I wonder if I could hit it from here. Whoa! Man, I hate those things. Man, and see, those are my chairs. These chairs were inside there and they are not anymore. People, people are annoying. <sighs> now that the wasps are dead, let's go see inside. One, I don't know, a bunch, but that guy's still alive. Oh, wasps are jerks. <sighs> Make sure there are wasps inside here. Uh, I don't know. Are there any wasps? I don't see any. <sighs> see, I had a window unit air conditioner right there. I had, but this doesn't make any sense because my camping stuff was in here. Look at this. So they left a perfectly good heater, a refrigerator. They left all of this stuff, but they took my camping supplies. Check this out. A little bathroom and stuff in here. Ooh, is that a bat? Oh, that might be a bat. I'm gonna go get my flashlight. Ah, uh, flashlight. It's a bat. 
That's totally a bat. Oh, look at that wasp nest. It's outside and there's nothing in it, but look how big it is. I wonder if there's anything inside the refrigerator. Nope. <gasps> Die. Ah. Get these guys put up and maybe people will leave me alone. And a lot. broke my watch. Maybe that'll keep them out. Arr, stay out. Ah, it is so hot. Louisiana summers are hot, man. And humid. Ah, oh, sauna out there. It's 96 degrees and probably, I don't know, 140% humidity. I know that's not how it works, but it feels like it's 140% humidity out here. It's hot. Oh, okay. Moral of the story today. Don't take people's stuff. Dang. I mean, what they got, it wasn't worth that much money. It, it, I'm not out much of anything except that my like security, like that's, that's my property. If it's not yours, don't take it. It's that simple. Nothing good comes from that. Nothing good comes from taking something that's not yours. Work for everything, earn it. You'll feel better about it. You'll be happier about it. Life will be better all the way around. Get off your butt and work for it. <sighs> Don't steal people's stuff. Anyway, could have been worse. My family's still safe. I'm good. They didn't burn down the cabin, so it could always be worse. If my wife gives me permission, then I will work on that cabin and do something cool with it. It may not be off grid, but it might be off grid. But if you follow, if you if you subscribe to my channel, you will know. If you don't subscribe, you will know. But if you subscribe, I'm gonna ask my wife's permission because that's what real men do. They ask permission, right? I'm gonna ask my wife's permission. And if my wife's okay with it, I will do something cool out there to that place and show you guys. All right, that's all I got for this one. If you wanna see what I do at that place, hit the subscribe button. Oh, hey, hit that like button too. When you hit the like button, it tells YouTube that I make decent videos and they show it to more people. And if they show it to more people, I can afford to do cooler things. So do that for me. Hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit that little notification bell thingy madoodle. I don't really know what it does because I'm new to YouTube, but I think you have to hit that bell for YouTube to tell you that I post new videos. So do all those things. Cause if you just subscribe, I don't think you actually get notifications. So. Do them all, please. I'm not gonna end the video until you hit the like button. I'm not, I'm not going to end the video until you hit the like, hit the like button. It's so, it's so simple. It's quick, just click. It's down there. I think it's on this side. Or is it on this side? I don't know yet. It's down there though. It's the thumbs up. Come on, subscribe. It'll be fun, come on. We'll do some cool stuff. There you go, thanks for hitting it.